AG Squad. Welcome back to my soda. Is it worth it? So this episode has this cool amazing part right here in my hand and basically what this is is a foot massager. So it has the option of kneeling, it has the option of shiatsu, they have a heat option, air compression option as well. And on the bottom, there's some more specs that's on there as well, you can see right there. So some other stuff that I should mention on the bottom part right here is the fact that it has a 15 minute auto shut off. So what that means is that after 15 minutes, it actually turns off by itself. So that's a good safety feature that's built in the product itself. So that way you don't have to worry about hurting your feet if you have to use it for too long. Next thing that I should mention right here is the fact that it has three different levels of intensity, which I'll show you guys that in a second. And last thing that I should mention right here is the fact that it has three rolling massage modes. So that just means that there's different modes on here that you guys actually use. But first thing first, I should open the product to show you guys what's included inside first before we actually test it out. All right, so when it's first open up, it should look something like this. Let's take that out, all right? So this is basically what the product looks like right here. All right, so this is basically what the product looks like right here. If you didn't see, very cool design. The overall product itself feels pretty high quality. So right here is the user manual that they provide for you guys right here to teach you guys how to use it. And right here is the cable that you want to use to activate the product itself and charge it up. So let me actually take this out first. So inside, this is basically what the cable looks like right here. So you want to plug this in the wall and then plug this onto the actual product itself. And I'll show you guys where to plug that in a second. If you guys can see, this is basically what the product looks like right here. So you want to put your feet in here and your feet in here. So that way you can actually use the product itself. They do have a very nice little handle that you can use to carry it if you guys want it right there. And top part right there, that is basically the switch and the button to activate it and everything. So this is basically what the side looks like right here. On this side. And on the strength. And on this side right here. And that is basically where to plug in the cable to activate it right here. If you can see. On the bottom part right here, 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 and here, they do have the anti-skate material to prevent it from like moving around. And they also have this extra part as well. So I lift it up. You guys can actually have the product stand up to a certain angle as well. And right here, they do have the anti-skate material as well to prevent it from like moving around. When you're done using it, you can close it back up. Just like that. And one last thing that I actually want to mention is the fact that inside where you guys put your feet, like right over here, they actually have a zipper right here where you can actually remove that part right there and take that part out. I believe you guys can take that part out and wash it if you guys want to. And the way how they made the heating option for the product itself is pretty cool because it has all the protection that you need on here to prevent the product itself from overheating. And then if you guys are curious about what are the benefits that's on the product itself versus other foot massagers out there in the market today, you guys can refer to their chart that they have right here. And the last and final thing is the fact that everything that's on the product itself that I mentioned already earlier, if you guys forget about what each different part is for, you guys can always refer to the image right here. So that is basically everything that's on the product itself. Now let me just put this down and show you guys how it works and what actually works first. And we'll come back and talk more about the product in a second. All right, so right here we have the product itself. We have it all plugged in. You guys can see that our light turns on right there. So what we want to do right now is to put our feet inside first and then we can activate it. You can see they have different stuff on here. So right here is basically for the kneeling option to turn on the kneeling option. The bottom right here is for the air compression. And right here is the heating option. So there's low, medium, high and low, medium, high here and it's low and high right here. So I'm gonna put my feet inside first and try it out. All right, so I got my feet in here. So I'm gonna press this button right here to activate it. All right, so you see that turns on. So we're now using low mode for everything. So I definitely feel the needling effect on the bottom part and there's definitely the air compression. The air compression is in the top part right here and also on the side as well. But the needling part is basically on the bottom part. So when I feel like the kneeling part right here, it definitely feels good. It's not like super strong or super painful or anything. Let me turn it higher. All right, so now we have high on everything except for the heat. The heat is on low. If I want it to be hotter, I can definitely turn up the heat right here. All right, so when I turn it on high for the intensity, for the kneeling option, and also for the air compression, it definitely feels a lot more stronger but it's not too strong to the point where I feel a lot of pain. But it's a good amount where I can actually feel enough of the massage. Let me actually move this to give you guys a different view of what the product looks like. Alright, so this is what it looks like from that angle. So that's the air compression right there. So basically release the air. And right now is the air compression starting again to compress inside your legs and everything. All right, so I lift this part up right here, the handle part right here. You can see we have the bottom part right here that I pushed out. So if you guys don't want to use the option, you can push back in, just like that. If you guys want to use it, pull it out like that. 
and then you can use the product itself like that if you guys want to. All right, welcome back, guys. So now you guys saw the quick test of product itself and then definitely see it actually works pretty well. It's definitely cool how they have all the different functionality on here, such as the needling effect, the shiatsu effect, air compression effect and the heating effect definitely very similar to a lot of other foot massages out there today in the market but if i were to compare this to the other foot massages i tested in the past i actually really like this a lot more because the overall design actually feels better and it actually feels like a higher quality product for this one as well and the way how they built this product is a lot different as well it makes it a lot easier for you to use but easy for you to carry as well because you have this little handlebar right here and they also have the bottom part right here where i showed you guys how you guys can push that up so that way you can angle in a certain way to make it a lot easier for you guys to use it. And obviously the product itself is super helpful for like pain relief, blood circulation, and the list goes on. But that is basically everything that's on the product itself. Now that we can unboxing and testing the product itself, now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth or not. So for me, honestly, I definitely have to say that any kind of foot massager in particular are super worth it. Especially if it has everything that's similar to this one right here, then it's super worth it. <laughs> But then obviously for those guys who don't want or don't need one or haven't one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.